Rigging Station, proudly presented by VMC, your expert in hooks. Hey guys, we just got back to the dock here and want to talk to you about the exact tackle that you're watching us fish today. We're fishing an eight foot chaos graphite rod. This is a custom rod that I designed myself specifically for mutton snapper and wreck fishing and bottom fishing. It's ultralight, graphite, soft tip, super sensitive, but yet plenty of backbone. We've got the rod matched to a Daiwa Saltiga 40 HA. We've got the same outfits with 35 HA reels. Either are gonna do plenty of line capacity silky smooth drag system, fast retrieve, just a perfect bulletproof reel for this type of fishing. The reel is loaded with 30 pound diamond braid. I can't stress enough how important that diamond braid is. Ultra sensitive, super strong, super thin, plenty of line capacity. And I'm telling you what, there's no other line you should be fishing. That's the bottom line. From there, we've got the braid connected to a very long leader, about 70 feet of 40 pound diamond presentation fluorocarbon. And we've connected that braid to that fluorocarbon with an Alberto knot. It's a simple knot to tie, but you've got to do it right. And when you do, it's absolutely bulletproof and reliable. The end of the leader, 5.0 VMC inline tournament circle hook, incredibly strong, incredibly powerful, but it's a light wire hook and that ensures that my bait is gonna be as natural as possible. And that's what I'm trying to achieve, a very natural presentation. These fish are not dumb. The small ones are dumb, the big ones are not dumb. From there, right on our braid, we tie a dropper loop close to where we connect that braid to the leader, about 12 inches away from the knot. On that dropper loop is where we connect our bank sinker, and that's gonna vary from 10 to 16 ounces. We connect it with a short length of 20 pound test mono in case it gets hung in the bottom, easy to break out. From there, I'm telling you what, I, I mean, I just can't stress it enough. Your tackle's gotta be in good shape. It's gotta be maintained properly. But throughout the day, check your leader often. That's another benefit to a long leader. If it's chafed up at the end, cut a piece off. If a knot doesn't look right, retie it, okay? Do these things. Check your drag after every drop or even while you're fishing continuously. It's the fundamentals that are gonna keep you in the game and that are gonna ensure that you're able to catch big quality fish like you watched us catch. And stick around because you haven't seen anything yet.